Hey guys, welcome back again. It's me, George, in a new tutorial, Modeling a Church. This is my reference to start. Right now, I'm going to create the roof of the church. This is missing structure with heightened geometry. I'm going to start using a box and create a poly and check my vertex. I'm selecting the top and create the inset. So I'm going to select the, the center and I'm going to use inset again. I'm going to create a, some kind of con. For this point in the structure, and you can see the high end, high end geometry from the top. And the perspective, you see the, the roof of the structure of the church. And just in the form with the scale, I have a, a nice, a nice uh, structure. So we have the, the first part and breaking in little pieces this chart because it's more easy to work. Now the next part is the brick. And then this brick is for the, for the walls and for the the fences from the church. I know again it's another box I'm using my symmetry and convert this in the poly. Remember you you watching right now in this moment is a normal speed of the tutorial. So if you wanna see a normal speed in my tutorial Check my website, and we have a normal speed tutorial. Okay? This is an overview of how you get it in the, in the normal speed tutorial. This is the normal box for the house on the 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 navy. The navy. This is the inside house. I'm going to change the color for see the, the another vertex and cut this and stir a little bit to get the exact shape and the other element for the house or the navy. This is uh, the right name for the structures of the for the church. I'm going to cut and <coughs> I'm going to select to extrude the, the roof. All right, the next part is this last part for this in the tower. It is a box cutting in three slices and take the vertex and chamfer it from the, from the corner. And so get in to create like a pyramid from the top and just adjusting the element to have this special kind corner to have these shapes now I'm showing for it this corner and 
adjusting the camera. And jump on this and it's stood outside with the top the point. So I have my structure, I'm gonna cut this and remember adjusting for any you have. The reference you can check out on my website is a Google image for search. But to do not do this work, I have the reference on my website and you can download the image to work. So, at this point, this is the base for the tower to create a strong basement for this heavy building or construction. And just in to align, align, excuse me. On the tower. So I may I slice create this corner and Create this special effect, cutting again, um, bevel it, and so on. Selecting, cutting, slicing, and bevel it like a Greek column. Charm for it, leeches. And again. Hmm. Have a little mistake here. I'm going to fix this. Just cutting again. And so let the, the, the corner. I create a second level for the tower. And repeat the last steps for the first level. The second level is basically the same of the the first level. So you can skip it in this part and have the right idea. Remember, this is an overview for creating this, this church. So watch out and through my side from the ultimate.com and watch it in normal speed. So I cut this and using my symmetry, you have the same size and same shape. Um, the house on the Nabi or the church. Now remember the the bricks. The bricks will be my fences and my structure roof. The roof church and I'm gonna use a Y for the bricks.
Um, the title is just a lapton. You can create the shape of them using lapton, and you have the title of the talk or the frame of the talk. This is in the, this is the, already the church with lighting and a great call to create an organization. Thanks for watching, and George, come back again.